Cinegear 2010 coverage. Brought to you by dvculture.com. Hey, I'm Ted from Red Digital Cinema. Some of you may have seen me before doing these kind of things. It's one of the things I have to do around here. Um, this is my friend Michael from Light Iron. He's showing off an Epic. That's an Epic camera here. This is our next generation red uh, camera. This is 5K camera. And this is full working configuration of this camera. You can actually go and shoot it just like this. Battery in the grip, compact flash. We're going to move to 64 gig compact flash cards pretty soon. Right behind it over here, if you want to sneak over here, this is the Red 1 with the new MX sensor in it. So it's the same sensor that's going into an Epic. We're now putting into Red 1s. We're upgrading customers um, week over week. So there's lots of these now out in the world. This is our new, what we call the Bomb EVF, which is a very small, very high resolution electronic viewfinder. And here's, of course, the LCD that chips with the camera. So this is the camera that David Fincher uh, just shot a movie called Social Network on that's coming out uh, pretty soon. They're in post-production. Um, this is the camera that's going on to the new uh, Pirates um, 3D, the big Bruckheimer movie um, that um, is getting ready to start shooting in Hawaii pretty soon. Uh, and many, many others. Uh, Soderbergh's um, last few movies, in fact, the last six or seven movies he shot have all been on red cameras. The last one he did is a movie called Knockout, all shot with these MX Reds. Uh, so you're going to see a lot of these things coming out in theaters pretty soon. So we're... Uh, in striking distance now of getting these out into the world. We're sort of in the last phases of um, doing the engineering and these will go out in very limited numbers in a program that we nicknamed Tattoo, which is uh, the, the very first epics that will be released to customers in very, very small numbers. And then it'll go through a testing and uh, learning phase with all those customers and then we'll go into mass production after that. Check out dvculture.com for further coverage.